Israel is located on the eastern Mediterranean Sea. Off the coast of the country is Cyprus. To the north, Israel borders Lebanon. To the east, Syria, Jordan, the West Bank and the Dead Sea. And to the south, the Red Sea, Egypt and finally, to the southwest, the Gaza Strip. The area of Israel is about 22,380 square kilometers. For comparison, Belgium is about 30,000 square kilometers. The country has about 9 million inhabitants. The capital is Jerusalem, but it's hardly recognized internationally as such. Israel is a parliamentary republic and is often considered the only democracy in the Middle East. The country's unicameral parliament is called the Knesset. The State of Israel was founded on May 14, 1948, and is the only majority Jewish state on earth. About 75% of the population is Jewish, but only a small portion is considered Orthodox or ultra-Orthodox. The sole official language is Hebrew, which was developed and revived on the basis of ancient Hebrew. Arabic is also a recognized minority language. Israel enjoys a very high level of human development, although there is a strong social inequality, especially to the detriment of the Arab minority. Israel's borders are partly disputed. The Golan Heights, originally part of Syria, were occupied by Israel in the 1967 Six-Day War and annexed in 1981. The Gaza Strip, located on the Mediterranean Sea, is administered by the Palestinian Authority and controlled by Hamas. The West Bank is also part of Palestine, but is only partially under Palestinian control. Many areas are controlled by Israel. In addition, Israel has faced international criticism for building Jewish settlements and security walls on Palestinian territory. Last but not least, Israel claims the entire city of Jerusalem. Jerusalem is the largest city in the country, with a population of over 900,000. It is home to the Knesset, the seat of the president, and the country's highest court. However, the status of the city is controversial, the eastern side being actually part of the Palestinian territory, but in fact controlled by Israel. Jerusalem is also an important religious center, considered a holy site by the three religions of Christianity, Islam and Judaism. The old city is divided into Armenian, Christian, Jewish and Muslim quarters and is home to the Wailing Wall, important for Jews, and the Al-Aqsa Mosque, significant for Muslims. Located on the Mediterranean coast, Tel Aviv is the economic, cultural and technological center of Israel. Although the city itself has only about 450,000 inhabitants, the conurbation known as Gashdan has a population of about 4 million. This means that almost 45% of the Israeli population lives in and around the Mediterranean metropolis. In addition to numerous international embassies, the city is also home to the Israeli stock exchange and various banks. Diamond processing is also important and the Mediterranean metropolis is considered an innovative technology center with a large number of startups. Tel Aviv and the surrounding area are therefore sometimes referred to as Silicon Wadi. As a cultural metropolis, Tel Aviv also attracts numerous tourists. In addition, there is also bathing tourism on the beaches of the Mediterranean Sea. To the southeast of the city lies Ben Gurion Airport, Israel's most important national and international air transportation hub. Behind Jerusalem and Tel Aviv, Haifa is the third largest city in the country. It is a major industrial center with large oil refineries and home to prestigious universities. Various technology companies have also set up shop here. It is also the world center of the Baha'i faith and therefore a destination for pilgrimages. The more populated areas along the coast have a Mediterranean climate, with hot, dry summers and rainfall in winter. In addition to olive trees, fig and carob trees are also grown. Cereals and citrus fruits are grown too. This is followed by a step-like transition zone. At high altitudes, there may even be snowfall in winter. 
The south of Israel is sparsely populated. The Negev Desert is located here. Due to the solar radiation, the region is increasingly used for power generation by means of photovoltaic systems. In addition, the Israeli military uses the desert as well. Because of the conflicts with Palestine and due to the historical threat from other states in the region, Israel has a strong military. There is a compulsory military service for men and women, 36 and 24 months respectively. The Iron Dome missile defense system, for example, is designed to protect against rockets from the Gaza Strip. Israel also has nuclear weapons as a deterrent, although this has never been officially confirmed. This is all about Israel for today. Thanks for watching, until next time.